Hey guys, welcome to Kiwi's Paranormal. So today we was heading to the beach, which I think we're going to do after, if it doesn't rain. Um, as we're driving past, we were driving past. Can you see it, guys? Right on top of that hill is a castle, guys. Corfe Castle. So Zach really wanted to go, and I said, yeah, why not? So we got about a 10 minute walk till we get to the actual ticket office. And then we've got to make our way up, guys. So wish us luck. And uh, I'll film a little bit of the walk there. Don't want to run my battery out, guys. But uh, yeah, we'll see you when we get you there. Go. we've made it to the top it was a bit of an effort because I've got to push the pram as well so I'm on out <laughs> but we're at the southwest gatehouse there we go so let's see oh there we've got something under there so we're just going to check in this part here wow this is cool Try and show you everything, guys. Excuse my breathing. <laughs> We've just had to walk nearly a mile to get here. And then we got to walk and go up steps. So I've got to try and get Jensen up the steps as well, guys. So let's move on. What do you want? Okay guys, we made it to the top. I've left the pram there because I cannot. I've already uh, pulled it up backwards up loads of steps, which I'll show you when we come back. I'm not putting them up them. Oh, I can't even talk now. <laughs> so we've made it to the top, guys. We're gonna have a quick look around. The outer bailey, the inner ward, life in the village, who did what. I cannot be able to read that right now, guys. So let's go. So it's crazy how the walls are all like tipping, you know? I'm not zoomed in, am I? No. Okay, so let's walk through the arch. I'm hoping to do a quick spirit box when no one's around, but it's quite a few people. So we've got a little walkway down there. It goes around to another bit, which we'll have a look at in a minute. Oh, cool, we can go up them. And... I still don't know what we This place is amazing, guys. Look what we did with an archway up there. Hope you can see that, it's quite dark on my screen. But um, yeah, let's have a little look. Okay, so we'll have to follow the other path round and that leads you down to there. So I'm gonna go up the stairs and see what the view's like there, guys. And uh, Okay, so we're up guys, this is the view from up here, sorry about wind, okay, keep 
four building. We literally had to cross that road down there, walk all the way through these trees, all the way around that path, up past them buildings, and then into this, into the gate entrance there. And then I had to push a pram all the way up there. All the way up there. All the way around. And up to here, guys. <laughs> so, I'm quite a, oh I'm not showing up there yet, hold on. Reverse, reverse. All right, let's show you this bit. There we go, I'm just gonna take a few pictures guys and I'll be back. Okay guys, we're gonna have a little wander through here. Whoa. Look at this place. This is cool. Okay, so this would have been a room. Show you guys the view from what I call a window. <laughs> oh wow. I love history guys. So uh Ooh. I'm trying to be a little bit fast just so I can check on second. Okay, so this is the keep self annex guys. So we've got push to lis listen, match this. Right, okay. Wow. So cool. This place is amazing. Oh, I just don't know where to point my camera because I want you to see all of it. <laughs> but there we go, there's, there's a view there. Such a cool view from here, guys. Oh, look at this part. That's where we just come from. We are going to head down there. There's, I don't know if you can see the really old church there, so I'm going to go over to that after. I don't know if it's got a, church, uh, a graveyard because there is a graveyard over on that area there, so I can't see any graveyards there, but it looks old, so I might do a little spirit box. I'm going to try and do a spirit box in a minute, guys. See what we can pick up. This place is just amazing, like, I can't take it all in. I just hope you guys like it and appreciate the video guys, so thumbs it up. Okay, sorry about the wind, I've left me muff in my bag. <laughs> so uh, yeah, down some more steps. This place is just, it's just amazing. I need to take some photos guys. Okay, so a 12th century skyscraper built in the early 1100s for King Henry, the son of William the Conqueror. It was designed to be impressive and it certainly was standing 23 metres, which is 80 foot tall and on the top of a 55 metre, which is 180 foot hill. We've just climbed 180 foot. That's what it used to look like, guys. It's amazing. I love it. Right, let's carry on. Let's have a quick look around. Ow, I just ripped my hair. Okay. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay. Sorry, guys, just we've had enough for you looking at that view. <laughs> so, uh, just made it quick. There's an old railway down there as well, goes across the bridge. Um, yeah, so, oh, look at that doorway. That is cool. The windows. Wow. Okay. Just look at the archways. It's just beautiful, guys. Absolutely beautiful. Sorry. Sorry if it's a bit dark. Okay, this is the outer walls, these are all the outer walls, okay, um, 
there's no one around here guys so I'm going to put the spirit box on quickly just setting it up Are there any spirits here? Hello? Can you tell me your name? Are you part of this castle? the other part, I don't think you went all the way down, did you? Mm. You want to have a look? Yeah. Just follow the path around. Mm. Hi, gents. Hey, guys, I'm just going to stand here. I don't know what questions to ask. I get sort of like, um... <laughs> Do you know my name? No, guys. My name's Melissa. Tell me your name. Can you tell me how old you are? part of this church. Did 
is Henry here. Just say like he's there. Is he near the steps? How many spirits are here right now? Can you tell me how many of you are here right now? Okay guys, so we've uh, been around the top part, we're going to make our way back down now. They've got an area down there on the grass for the kids where they can build like an arch and a wall and things. So, uh, once we get, get down, I'm going to have a rest and let the kids have a little run around and a play. Um, yeah, so we, got, we had a few um, EVPs. So guys, remember to listen out for me. If I don't know, I will put a question mark if I don't understand what they've said. Um, but hopefully we've got something really good on there. It's hard to hear with the wind blowing, so hopefully it came out okay. But obviously watching this you'll see so we're gonna make our way down guys uh, just gonna show you this little bit here as well because I didn't do it when we came up so we're gonna head over here first. I need that bench. <laughs> so this is the next part. Look how cool that is. I love it. It's a good spot in here. <laughs> I don't know what this bit would have been. This is in the uh, circle. You know the circle bit. Maybe a lookout or something. I'm gonna try and cover the wind. Uh, but yeah, it's a long way down guys This is so cool. I love this place but Yeah, so that's That bit and this is the next bit So we're gonna head over there quickly So you can see the stone see a stone here so that would have gone down to the next part. History and evil deeds. Corf Castle has had a long and colourful history with nearly a thousand years of use, misuse and neglect. Kings, lords and ladies have occupied and added to the castle, creating what you see here today. They have fought over it, imprisoned each other here and carried out all manner of deeds, some good, some evil. A treasury, a prison, a haunting lodge, a home, dungeons. The wicked stepmother, guys. I'll let you read that. You can pause it and read it. Right, careful with him, Zach. So, we're just going to head down this bit. A quick look. Wow. Look at the different like, brickwork there. That's awesome. I like Right, what's this one say? It says... No idea. That's what it says, guys. So... Nesting. You see a different star ball, guys? 
like it's crisscrossed, where uh, the other parts are just like slated and stuff. So you got to push him back up now. You got to push him back up. Hey guys, this is the South Tower. So I'll just show you guys here. South Tower. So, a big drop. <laughs> Ouch. Whose poo is this? Do we really have to look at poo? Yeah. Yeah. Wabbit. Bat. Mouse poo. I don't know, guys. Ooh, that's a better view from the, out the outside, bit, actually. I'm going to take a photo. Okay guys, so we're heading down now, um, probably about halfway down, so I'm going to let the kids have a little play, Zach's already down there playing, uh, so I'll film them a little bit and then uh, I think we're going to head off to the beach guys, so you'll see that on my family channel, so uh, yeah. there is a few little outbuildings here that we're going to look in um yes yeah, so it's not right it's not over just yet <laughs> so here we've got some old style wheelbarrows they're just for the kids to knock about on right so this, we've got this one here so this is a stonemason workshop medieval timber frame buildings were often prefabricated similar to flat packs today wow look at this See, that's how they would make it. They used to use poo. <laughs> As you can see over there, that's how they would slot it all in. Wow, this is so cool. So here we've got Purbeck marble. There we go, guys. The appearance door which was there. Part of the semi-circular mold mouldings can just be seen through the window of the South Annex. Uh, the keep was built by Henry in 1106 as a prison for his brother Robert of Normandy who was threatening to take the English throne. The South Annex, the sticky out bit on the south wall of the keep was added later and hides the ornate mouldings uh, of a Roman square, Roman skew or Norman door. There we go. Right, so this was the carpenter's workshop. Carpenters were important in the buildings of the castle. They constructed timber frame workshops and were responsible for putting up the wooden scaffolding and assembling the uh, centrings which supported the arches and vaults during their construction. There's a witch's broom there. Witch's broom. Oh my god, look at that little pot down there, it's so cute. The arch, how they build the archways. That's so cool. Obviously, part of the castle, guys. So, there it says the Horseshoe Tower. So, we're going to go over to this little building now. Look how cool it is in here. Wow. I love it. Got a table, we've got like a little chair seat, a stool, the bucket, some fur, <laughs> another seat, basket, an apron, some other bits here, and a chest. Does it open? Oh, it does open. Okay, we've got some string and maybe another apron in there, I'm not sure what that is. Cool, I like it. You see how? They were made. This is this is great, guys. Look, I love it. And that's the little view out with the kids playing. Just